Good morning, dear students. <coughs> Today we are going to learn lesson number two, up to 20 years. It is written by O. Henry, a well-known writer. It is a story about to first or uh, two true friends who have departed before 20 years and they have decided, they have taken the oath that they will meet, meet met there after 20 years at the same place where they departed. Oh, let's begin. A policeman walked down the empty street. It was barely 10 o'clock, but there was no one on the street. The chilly wind and slight rain had taken care of that. As he walked, the officer checked doors to make sure they were locked. All shops had their shutters down. Everyone had gone home. After about 20 more paces, the officer slowed his steps at the closed door of a store. There stood a man leaning against the door with a scar in his mouth. <clears throat> As the policeman reached him, <clears throat> the man looked up and said, It's all right, sir. I'm just waiting for a friend. You'll find it funny. It was an appointment made 20 years ago. As the policeman looked on, the man explained, if you don't trust me, let me tell you, there used to be a restaurant here instead of this store. It was called Big Joe Brady's Restaurant. Yes, but it was turned down five years ago, replied the officer. The man nodded and lit his car. In the light of the match, the policeman could see that he had a pale face, scared jaw and sharp eyes. He had a little scar near his right eyebrow. His scarf was held together with a diamond pin. <coughs> Twenty years ago, this very night, continued the man, I dined at this restaurant with my best friend Jimmy Wells. He was the finest person in the world. You see, we grew up together in New York like brothers. I was 18 years old and Jimmy was 20. That night, 20 years ago, we were dining here. The next day, I was to go to the West to make my fortune. Jimmy did not come with me. He never wanted to leave New York. For him, this was the only place on earth. That night, we made a promise to each other that 20 years from then, no matter what happened, no matter how far we were from one another, we would meet here. In 20 years, we knew that both of us would have found our destiny. So let me explain. The scene begins. A policeman was walking down the empty street. Empty means that's not filled. Its antonym is full. Or we filled. Oh, a policeman was walking down the empty street. It was evening time and uh, winter uh, season. It was barely 10 o'clock. It was uh, 10 p.m. But there was no one on the street. In uh, New York like city, it uh, seems funny that the streets were empty. The chilly wind and slight rain had taken care of that. <clears throat> Why were streets empty? Because it was uh, due to the cold, This uh, the chilly wind and slight rain. Because of these two things, there were no one in the vision in these streets. As he walked, the officer checked the doors to make sure they were locked. It is. It was his duty to check whether doors were locked or not. All shops had their shutters down. The policeman found the uh, the shutters of all shops. They were down. They were locked. They were closed. Everyone had gone home. Gone here has used. Gone is third form of go. So its first form is go. Second form is went. After about more 20 paces. The policeman was walking. After 20 more paces, after 20 more steps, the officer slowed down his steps. He, he slowed down his uh, moment, his steps, at the closed door of his store. He, what uh, happened? He saw there was a man who was leaning against the door with a scar in his mouth at the closed door of a store. There was a store at its closed door he found a man who had a cigar in his mouth as the policeman reached him. The man looked up and said, before policeman could uh, 
question him or uh, interrogate him he replied before it's all right sir i'm just waiting for a friend the man thought maybe the policeman would got got suspicious whether i am a thief or uh, it it's all right sir he justified himself i am waiting for a friend that's why i am here leaning against the door you will find it funny what he was doing here he was waiting for his friend he said that it's it may seem to the policeman funny that he is waiting there for a friend it was an appointment made 20 years ago it seems funny it is a uh, unbelievable that uh, before 20 years if someone made a promise to meet someone or uh, made an appointment after 20 years it is uh, too much funny it is too much it is unbelievable that uh, someone will remember such promise but the man has uh, come and uh, he was waiting for his friend there as the policeman looked on the man explained if you don't trust me the man further tried to explain to the policeman that if he don't trust him he narrated the story there used to be a restaurant here instead of the store so he said that there was used to be a restaurant now there is no restaurant there was a big store that's known as big joe brady's restaurant the restaurant right now store is uh, the restaurant was named as Big Joe Brady's restaurant. Yes, but it was torn down. The policeman replied that it was torn down five years ago. The man nodded and lit his cigar. So, in the light of the match, the policeman could see that he had a pale scar, pale face, scar jaw and sharp eyes. <clears throat> when the man who was waiting for his friend, when he lit his cigar, the policeman saw his face. His face seemed to he seems like pale face he had scared jaws and sharp eyes he had a little scar near his right eyebrow the policeman found a scar near near his light, right eyebrow his scarf was held together with a diamond pin so it, uh, it seems that uh, it showed that the man was too rich he was a rich person it's enough today thank you